Welcome to Cutting with Kids. My name's Kalia. And my name's Andrew. Today we're in Scratch. So today we're going to show you my project, Minecraft Dungeon. So it's a test project. So first you, you're going to control Steve with your mouse or your finger. And you need to avoid the zombie and pillager. Both of them are monsters and you try to survive for 60 seconds. That means one minute. Let's try it. So now Steve is following my mouse and they're trying to get me. So I just got damaged and got attacked. Now there's more mobs and my health went down. Okay, so let's see the code for Steve. So when green flag click, that means when you run the project, go to X0 and Y0, that means the middle. Then switch costume to Steve, that means the regular costume. Then set health to 20. So your maximum health is 20. And then forever, go to mouse pointer. So Steve will follow your mouse or your finger. And then when green flag clicked, forever. So it will keep ch forever checking the if. If health equals 0, that means you lose. And then broadcast game over. So game over is a message to other characters. So when I receive attack, that means when Steve receives the message attack. Switch costume to damage Steve so he gets damaged. And then play some hit sound until Oof. done. So, so you can know that he's damaged. Then change health by minus one. So minus one, one health from the health variable. And then switch costume to Steve. So I'll go back to the regular costume. Or look, then wait 0 0.1 seconds, so it will wait very little. Okay, then let's go to the zombies code. So when green flag clicked forever, glide one second to Steve. So it will follow Steve. Yeah, follow Steve for one second. And then if touching Steve, that means if it touches Steve, switch costume to zombie, that means the usual costume, and then broadcast attack and create clone of myself. So a clone is like a, a copy of this character. So and then wait 0 0.2 seconds to do this again. Okay, so when it touches Steve, it will broadcast attack and Steve will get damaged. Okay, so when I start as clone, so now I'm coding the clone, that means the copy, forever. Glide one second to Steve. If touching Steve, then switch costume to zombie broadcast attack. Wait 0 0.2 seconds. So this is just like the code for the usual zombie, but it doesn't create another clone. Yeah, so if Steve is touching the clone zombies, it won't make another zombie. Yeah, the zombie won't make another zombie. Only the original zombie can make another zombie. So next, the pillager, another monster. So the code is just like the zombie except the costumes and yeah, that's basically all. But the zombie doesn't have an attack costume <laughs> because the pillager has a weapon. It has a attack costume. So switch costume to pill attack. So pill is a short name for pillager, and then it will go into the attack mode and broadcast attack. So again, Steve will get damaged and create a clone of myself. So the clone code is also like the zombie clone code too. Yeah, so it has pill attack and broadcast attack. but. Yeah, but again, it doesn't create another clone where there will be more clones than you expected. Yeah. Next, this is the dungeon. So this is the background. So when I receive game over, hi. So it will disappear. So the game over sprite, that means the game over screen, will show. And then when green flag clicked, forever play sound, Minecraft dungeons. Yeah, so this is a song, well, a sound. And it's going to forever do it. Yeah, okay, then game over screen. So when I receive game over, the message, show, for, then it will show, and the dungeons, that means the background will hide, so you can see the game over screen, and then forever. Wait, 0 0.1 seconds, next costume, because it has a lot of costumes, and then when green flag clicked, hide, because you don't want, when you run it, it's game over already. Oh no! That will, I even play it. That will be crazy. And then win. The win sprite is 
it will tell you when it will win. So when green flag clicked, reset timer. So you see there's a timer here and it's still running. Yeah. Okay, so when green flag clicked, you can reset the timer. Then wait 60 seconds. That means one minute. Yeah, and if health more than zero, that means you're still surviving. Then reset timer and say you survived. That you, means you win. Yay! Yeah, you, you just need to survive for 60 seconds. Now, let's play. Uh, After Ader plays, it's my turn. Okay. Oh. I'm gonna let them hit. Oh, now, now there's four. There's four monsters. But they can't see this. Oof. Oh, you can attack them. Gotta run away from them. Ah, they're creepy. They're creepy. They're mm. creepy. Hey, my turn. Okay. Uh, when it's 30 seconds, it's my turn. Okay. Oof. That is 27. 20. My turn. Okay. Let's restart. Your Only turn. 30 seconds. Ah! Yeah, the are ready. Because yeah. they, they yeah. spawn right on top of me. Yeah, you have 19 health. Hi, hi, hi. They need, like, time to attack us. Yeah, and they follow you for just one second, so they may, they ma they may not attack Oh, man. Oh. You attack me like, ooh, ooh, ooh. Like, that's so. free hits. Uh, help, they're chasing me. Mm. Help. 30 seconds, you survived. Yeah. Ah, uh, they were hit. <laughs> and mm -hmm. thanks for watching. Remember, Remember to smash the like button and subscribe. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.